Welcome to the wood shop. My dad found this big log from a cherry tree, and today we're going to cut it up so we can get a look at the wood. Safety first. We need to protect our eyes and ears while working with wood and loud tools. Ready to go. First, we measure the length we want. Then we cut the wood into smaller pieces using the miter saw so it will be easier to work with on our other tools. Holding the log still and keeping our fingers away from the blade helps keep us safe. This log is a little too big for this saw, so we finished up the cut with a hand saw. Cherry is a hard wood. Now that we have a smooth cut, you can see all the rings inside the bark. Next, we'll use the bandsaw. Instead of a circle saw blade, this one looks like a metal rope full of cutting teeth. We're using a new blade to make sure it is nice and sharp. It goes around the top flywheel, through the table, and around the bottom flywheel. Then we'll tighten it up, making sure everything is lined up, and we're ready to cut. Because this piece is still pretty long, we're working together to be safe. One person is holding the log to keep it from rolling or falling while the other person pushes it through the blade. We go slow at the end so we don't hit the metal fence. Next, we cut the log in half. When you want to make boards, you want to make long pieces that go with the direction of the tree, not circles. Plus, it will be easier to cut when we have a flat edge. See the straight lines? That's called the grain. To make the edge even flatter, we use a jointer. Now we can go back to the bandsaw. The fence makes sure every piece will be the same size, and the push block keeps our fingers further from the blade. We left the bark on this log so you can see all the parts from the log. Can you see how this wood is different? It's a different color and it doesn't have any bark. This is pine and it's a soft wood. It cuts so much easier and faster than the cherry. One last tool. To make our disc smooth, we used an orbital sander to quickly make the wood smooth. Thanks for joining us as we broke down a log into smaller pieces of wood. Now you can imagine the wood inside every tree you see.